It is time for the biggest Europa Universalis game of all times. 60 players. Hola, hola, amigos. Is there a player map? Yeah. Oh, we have a Morocco. That's not good. Ooh, I was scared of that. Hello, puppets. Is this the Pope? It's the Pope. It's, it's, His Holiness. Is, His Holiness, oh. the Pope. In nomine Patris et Filii Spiritus Sancti. Is that good? The worst thing, the same okay. opinion, estates. Do I already seize land right now? Okay, Whoa. so here's how you want to set them up. You want to take all of your uh, monthly Mana. power points. Plus one military and plus one diplomatic power. There you go, yeah. And now I have 0% crown land. Okay, now you sell land. Sale of titles. Click that button. Sale of titles? Bam. Go into infantry. Okay, go to production and build a bunch of infantry all on one tile. Uh, okay, all on, okay, I'm building all on, all on one tile until you have no manpower left. Oh, we're already cheating? Now go back into your estates and yes. hit summon diet. Summon the diet. Done. Yes. Okay, and go for the nobility. That it says 50% manpower. You might get unlucky and not get that. I have the manpower. You're a fucking cheater, you know that? <laughs> and, then, and then cancel all those troops you're building. <laughs> you fucking asshole. <laughs> Cheater. Okay. It's good. It's good. I'm teaching you the ways. The advisors we want to buy in the start of the game and every single EU4 game is inflation advisor and trade advisor. Okay. Oh, this okay. is important because this will give you a event which will give you 200 admin mana and 200 diplo mana. Yeah. Trade efficiency plus 10. We agree a 40 years of development between... Iberia and Morocco. I will not um, get involved in any affairs in Northern Africa at all. As soon as you see the new world, you want to send like two, three, like three K troops there to start exploring the new world with a conquistador. I have a huge event to choose what my king shall do and I shall probably give him trade efficiency. Do what you think is best. Okay. Trust your intuition. Choose goods produced. Okay, I'm doing goods. I'm listening to you chat. Another person just died. Two people already died, Tommy. Like they didn't disconnect, they just actually died? They actually died, yeah. Two people already died. Who, who were they? <laughs> Why? Vijayanagar and one guy I don't know because it just says AI. So Vijayanagar sounds like uh, India? India, yeah. And now it's up to you to like look at your mission tree and see what you can accomplish as well. Okay. But right now I'm just trying to really jump into Brazil ASAP, right? Yes. Okay. And get CMOPs here. Can I predict that other nations are currently also checking out America like England? Oh, definitely. We're going to okay. have to talk about that soon. I'm actually probably going to gather the treaty soon. Marines take less shock damage and they use your sailors instead of your manpower. Ah, they uh, disembark very fast, I see. You can summon a diet. That's always a mission you want to do, right? Mm, build a church. I'm broke anyway. Have a big army. I'm broke anyway. Have 50% trade in Gibraltar. Nah. Build one church. I have a bonus, right? But I have no money. My dearest Pope! Portugal requests money so we can build churches in Lisbon. Oh, I'll get him. <laughs> Pope, the emissary from Portugal has arrived. My dearest holiness, Ave Maria, Espiritu Sancti. My clergy just told me we need to build a church in Lisbon. It is a great mission of ours, yet we are a poor, poor nation. So here today, my dearest of popes, I'm asking for a small loan of a million uh, of enough ducats to build a humble church in Lisbon. Once my great companies have gold and riches in the new world, it shall be paid back to his, the Holy See. What's the amount of loan we're talking about? That's a good question. 90 gold. And you shall receive 110 pope? back when the time's right. We're gonna since, it's a, since it's a church, <clears throat> the Pope will see what he can do. Oh, and we will not oh, ask yeah. for money back. What? Oh! Oh! oh. Man, the people but of Lisbon will... Because it's a church. Thank you so much, my dear. Hunt for... Should I hunt for the seven cities? Yes, 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 okay. yes. Okay, it's time to look, my brother, oh! for the Fountain of Youth. What is going on with the colonial game? Okay, I want de jure. I, I had a vision, per se. Henry, in one of his fever dreams, he, he drew a picture, a map of the of a land out west and he called it the united states of america i need this land is it time to gather the catholics and begin faring up the new world i don't even know what the new world is what new world if you go west you go to india dude yeah what does that mean what are you talking about of course apparently there's an untapped island over there henry he swears by it apparently there's like norse pagans and shit over there it's crazy norse pagans he said that's where valhalla has always been we just never knew what? The Norwegians are saying- Hey, what is this? Oh, we're gonna get the King of Norway in here. Hello? King of Norway? Yo, what up? <laughs> so, yo, what up? <laughs> I reached a new continent. You've already reached a new continent? You're already there? 
Well, my, sa my sailors have been there, but not they haven't landed yet. Ah, okay. So what have you found? What have you found in the west? We found some land that's very icy and cold. I think we'll call it Greenland to make uh, to fool people. <laughs> I have great news. Napoli has decided to contribute on the building of the church oh. in Lisbona. I will build that so right the, away. Thank you, His Holiness. The word can be spread across the continent. Thank you so much, sir. There's also the question of the New World players, because there is an Aztecs and a Cusco. Aren't they like ultra weak because they have no tech or some shit? Yeah, but they will catch up to tech immediately. <clears throat> and they also have, by protection of the rules, until tech 8. So, like, you can't rush them down. Because okay. that'd be kind of lame anyways, okay, like, yeah, before what, they could do anything. Theoretically, right? What if yeah. the Aztec player just intentionally did not get tech 8? He just stays like that forever. I mean, he can do that, but what's that would the be point? very base. That would be quite. What's base, the point? Oh, you must confess that would be very base. <laughs> he just stays like that forever. Problem. He's like you can't attack me. You can't attack me. Yeah, we well, via the rule set. If we're being listen, okay. Henry's having another vision. <laughs> He sees the timeline. Hey, thank you, Mr. Pope. I mean, dude, we can make all of the New World Catholic. Dude, sh look at these maps. I found the New World, gentlemen. I just need to show you the maps somehow. Uh, Zil, you give me it to Morocco, Tommy. Oh, shit. I clicked the Morocco share maps. <laughs> no, wait. No, I didn't. I didn't. Oh, shit. Money. I have three colonists. Chat said you should always go for natural trade centers or some shit. Okay, I got you one. Okay, I'm spreading into Brazil like a cancer. Oh, uh, dude, why so negative? Like a, instead of like a cancer, like um. Well, I, I, I don't think this is gonna go well for the natives, you know. Don't you have the coexistence policy? Are well, you coexisting? Coexisting for now, man. One day they will have a thing called Thanksgiving where they celebrate how I killed all these motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, <laughs> well, it's your fuck holiday. I'm not American. <laughs> hey, dude. Right now, Brazil it diverts to either uh, it diverts to West Africa, which is why I said after Brazil, we want to get control of the Ivory Coast. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to divert the trade from Brazil using merchants. We're going to divert the trade okay, from Brazil okay. to West Africa to Sevilla. And the more you divert, so there's a thing called trade steering. The more trade gets diverted, the more money gets added on, and the more money you get. Ami, don't listen to him. He's trying to bleed you dry. Send it to the English channel. I think so too, yeah. I swear to so God. So I, I should rush the, um, the Ivory Coast. We have a very, we have a very right nice 57, 40% right now. I remember years ago, that's why I loved you for this colonization stuff. It's really fun. Oh, I got my first ability. And oh, settler increased. There you go. Tommy, you took the wrong one. Oh, fuck. I fucked up. Oh, I and took the wrong one. The... Did you oh, click I the didn't decision, take by the way? Increased. Oh, I took colony development boost. Oh, that was wrong. Shanghai. There's a Shanghai player and he might f you. Oh, there's a Shanghai player. But Shanghai there is, is Yeah, Asia. we're going to have to fight him. We're going to have to talk to him. Shanghai is uh, in Africa, West Africa. They're the kingdom of Shanghai. We've heard legends of them in West Africa. Mm. My we... opinion, Brazil, West Africa is the play. I will do it. But then Shanghai is a problem. Okay, we'll think about that. We're going to have to discuss diplomacy. What do you think? This is just going to be some easy cakewalk game with AIs. We might have to fight player wars, Tommy, and protect our land. Well, I'm ready to kill a man. We're fucking where I bury a man. We ain't no bitches. Mm -hmm. I'm binding my dynasty with Aragons. And now Diberian Aragon winning. is oh, under shit. a personal union with Castile. Oh, oh, guys, the Treaty of Tortoisias is happening. Tortoisias. Here we have the Pope. We have the Kingdom of Norway, we have the Duke of Brittany, we have the King of Portugal, the King of England, and um, I think that's everyone. I can see the New World now, and now I know that the West does not lead to India. In we ask for... for ages. Okay, you don't need to brag, you Let him speak. Norwegian. Does he have the arrogant trait, huh? Yeah, <laughs> is that what I'm saying? Castile wants the Caribbeans and Colombia, or what we call Colombia, Colombia named after my explorer. Who found it first? Hello? What does so I mean? with you having most of the Caribbean, but we want Cuba for ourselves. Small the place. island of Cuba? Yes. You've uh, started Cuba, colonizing okay. Havana! It's rightful Spanish claim! We're this from is gonna the lead to war, Norway. This is gonna lead to war. Why did you have to get into the Caribbean? Why couldn't you go into some other lands, unclaimed land? Um, you knew yeah. that this land would be contested, and it goes directly into our trade. It goes into many trades, not just yours. This is gonna lead to war. Pope, what do you help me out? Back me out on this. Stop your colonizing of Havana. You can still stop it. A few gentlemen would like would let the Pope speak his mind. In my opinion, Portugal gets to decide who gets the land. <laughs> Small piece. <laughs> I will not talk about this matter anymore. My son, the Pope, has spoken. I feel like you guys gotta talk about North America, though. The Bretons are there too now. <laughs> I need to make a petition. Uh, Can I have the floor? My provinces? Chesapeake Bay okay. belongs to me. I'm just gonna say that right now. Gentlemen, if I could interfere for one second. Gentlemen, in the you south, let Portugal speak. A, a moment, massive yeah. 
Moroccan Empire is growing. If we Catholics fight among each other, we're going to be in huge trouble when the Islamists and other religions are coming for us. I urge you all to be friendly to each other and not wage war over these colonies. Great you words speak, from a wise you speak man. Speak wise words, but if we don't resolve this now, it will just happen way later. I have my claims. Oh, what? The French to... are in here? Where did the French come from? Oh. Do the French even have colonists? <laughs> they do. We all have colonists. I'm all then here, maybe son. let them explore some taste. Devastation. The little touch of Brittany. He's, he's the we little. We survived Duke. on these small lands. We just want our peace in the new world. Okay, so what right. lands does the Duke of Brittany like to exp to to migrate to? The place called Massachusetts. And Wampanoag. No! Oh. <laughs> Come on, give the little guy somewhere to expand. This English king is not being reasonable. What do you mean, Henry has had vision? How about how about you let him have the states of Massachusetts and Vermont? I swear to God, before he even said Massachusetts, I already started colonizing Massachusetts. Uh, I, don't, I don't believe a word of that. Uh. Before we even made a decision, he started colonizing the disputed land. It's not disputed. Listen, it's in no Henry, man's land. Henry the Sixth had visions. He he said them far and wide. He said, "Agartha is to the west." I think Go they west. should be rewarded for their hard work. If they got there first, they earned it. Oh, by the way, just to get out of the way, everyone's fine with Portugal getting the rest of South America besides Colombia. No All in favor. What? Who said what that? What is his name? Who said France, that? France, France, France. What did, what did people get? The De Balboni. How about you? Their land. You can get Louisiana. It's named after you. We even named it after you. Kingdom of France. What is your proposal? I declare. I don't know what I. Think. You don't even know I what need, you want. I would say go to South America. Two people can't control that continent for itself. Who the said that? Is, is that Norway it? again? Norway again, oh my god. I hereby in front of the holiness right. and all these I'm witnesses. The French Navy. We have to claim. I'm building the Spanish Navy. I'm, I'm building the Spanish Navy. That these Norwegians believe in old gods, these heretics. They su they try to meddle in our affairs and destabilize these great Christian lands. Pope, you need to start making you need to start making the calls here. Without your without your input, we are going to delve into chaos and madness. I you say decide. Brittany gets a small land in Canada. And what are the Norwegians asking exactly? They're just riding their way. You were paper, see, if I can be clear, uh, this bozo is just bozo. waiting for us to start fighting each other while he's calling us. No need to call us names. No need to call us names. Very Let's be civil. Like, we're not natives. We're real Catholics. Well, we're, not, we're not like well. those natives we're conquering. So, Pope, make the final claims of the new, entire New World and it will be announced. Who gets what? Say it now. Or forever hold your peace. Caribbean goes to Portugal. He gets to decide who takes it. Okay. They can give one state to the Nor Norwegians, so we don't, we don't we don't need internal problems in the Catholic the English, League. The English. English. English wanted one one state there. I want Mexico. The English can have one state. They, France don't get anything. Malacca claims California. Oh, we don't know who Malacca is. Get out of here. Who is this? Get out of here. I'm getting him out. I'm getting Who's out. That? This is all Catholic. This is a place for Catholics. The if you're not a Catholic, get out. Portugal gets Mexico. A state in northern Mexico goes to Norway. A state in Caribbean goes to England. Caribbean Colombia goes to the, to the Spanish. Canada get, it goes to Britain. The rest of the Chesapeake Bay goes to England. You get the north part. So Sorry, what's what? I'm France. in Mexico now? I was peeing. What? I have... What Mexico? You, Portugal, you, you Mexico? Get, you you get Mexico, except for North West. You get. Oh, you I get don't one even want that, sir. I'm so happy, but um, my can, colonists you can, are so, you so can busy. donate it to to uh, to somebody. Give it to me. I'll take it. Give it to me. I'll take it. Give it to me. Give it to me. I'm hereby giving rights to all my necklaces and claims to England for a small gift <laughs> of money. I, we need to wrap this up. This has been going on for years. Hear ye, hear ye, for it is I, the great Fernando de Menezes. Here, where I found the Inca Empire in South America. Hello, welcome. It is great to meet the natives. As I walk oh, into your lens, I think I just found El Dorado, bro. Oh shit. It is a great honor to meet you. I am the emperor of the Inca Empire. Emperor. I come here today as a new man, a white man. I've never seen anyone of your color and you've never seen anything of my color. But I come here today I come here today, I want to make sure you understand I'm not your enemy. I didn't come here to take these lands from you or any other natives that might live further north. In the yeah. land I come from Europe, there's things called, we call them goblins. They're greedy there. They're evil. They can't be trusted. We call them the French and the Norwegians. And I come here today in good faith to tell you secret information that these goblins, we call them in Europe, are coming for your lands. All across this great continent, they're coming to take what's yours and to take your people and women. 
I personally don't like them, and I hereby today want to reach my hand out to the natives of America, telling you that United we could stand against these colonizers of France and Norway. Those people for... sound very barbaric. Exactly. Oh shit, wait, I just made a gold mine. Yo, man, what the fuck? Oh shit, I found a gold mine. <laughs> That's not good, right? <laughs> oh shit. The deal I'm looking for with you guys is for mutual assistance, for help, for friendship, as I will protect you against any other incoming colonizers you might face. Very happy to hear from a friend from another world. Also, have you guys heard I, of Jesus? Well, let's talk about that later. Also, wear a mask. I might actually kill you guys. I have, I have the flu right now. So, have you heard about us saving the world constantly? What do you, what do you mean? What are you talking about? The oldest of gods are willing to destroy the planet. And we are the, oh. the only ones keeping them happy enough to not do so. That is not good. That We shall do something about that, obviously, yes. We but are sacrificing some people for it. You should even sacrifice some Norwegians and French motherfuckers for that. Maybe I can even bring you some of them. I hope we can do that together. And I don't want to fuck with you guys. I want to coexist. Which is why I came here today to look for a deal of coexistence. <sighs> These great lands of Brazil and Argentina look ripe. Whereas in this deal, the entire rest of South America belongs to the mighty and beautiful Inca Empire, obviously. Okay, I will take my expansion north then. Oh, that's a good deal, man. Nice deal, man. Nice deal. Uh, nice. King of Portugal, I saw that you were speaking. I heard news that you speak to the tribes, the, what? the uncivilized tribe in the New World. No, I was just taking vacation for my new country of Brazil. I was just hanging a bit. Hey, who colonized Cape? Me. Um, we, we never talked. To, we talked about America the whole time, didn't we? Listen, Tommy, listen. you're ruining my f***ing... You're, you're busting listen, my balls here. I don't want to bust your balls, but if you would listen for a second, I gave you rights to all of Mexico for donation. I don't see the nation coming to Lisbon yet. I must say I'm very offended. Careful, man. These English motherfuckers are trying something. What the hell? What am I trying? Yo, who the fuck trying? took? Yo, England. What the fuck you doing it's in North Brazil, man? It, I need it for colonial region, for colonial range. I will leave. Okay, let's Same make deals. Let's make deals. Let's make deals. Because I kind of like you. We all should be careful of Shanghai, Morocco, France, and Norway. And I truly believe yeah, Iberia should work with England. This will really benefit us all. Oh, oh, the, oh, I'm also I'm a very uneducated king. Apparently, the Cape is South Africa. I'm not in the Cape. I'm not in the Cape. You sure you want to give the Cape to Britain? You have a lot of missions for it. Look, when I look for good relationships. I think we have a lot of Morocco, Shanghai, uh, Infidels, France, Norway. They all look like enemies. I need to talk to France. Okay, now quick. the game is getting fun because I'm getting rich as hell. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah. Now it's you get getting rich fast, fun, man. See, Mops, if you ever rebel against me, man, I will never talk to you ever again. Technically, they're not allowed to unless you, like, allow it. So. Hey, I don't allow it. <laughs> Fuck you, bro. <laughs> and people are so good. Ethiopia already is taking all of Africa, man. People are so fast growing. I think in South America, I only want Brazil and Argentina, and then I just keep going. What should be my next idea? I'm getting a bit hungry for war a little bit. I'm kind of ready to fuck with someone soon. Trade? Trade makes a ton of sense, I guess. Yeah, trade makes mega sense, I guess. I'm feeling trade. We're playing a trade nation after all, aren't we? Shanghai is probably very mad at me. That's why I have my army here, because I think Shanghai wants to fuck hard, man. Go for military. You need military. Plutocratic is really plutocratic. Plutocratic. I hate mercenaries. I hate mercenaries, chat. But why you guys? Why? 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 Why plutocratic? Why? Can you guys explain? Why? Mercenaries are ultra necessary in multiplayer. Probably true. Players probably take a lot of mercenaries, and without them, you get wrecked multiplayer. Hmm. You're probably right. Shit. Should I do? Should I do mercenaries? I never do that actually. Maybe I should. Yeah, to my uh, dear friends, England and Castile, my first war might be Shanghai. I'm already amassing an army there. All right. We're gonna have to go a quick. We're gonna have a quick warfare guide. Well, you take an army and you click on the enemy. There's more to it. I think he's covered everything, actually. I watched your video. That's basically what you said, Habibi. <laughs> no, I would not break the law. Yo, yo, yo. Songhai wants to attack me. He just said that. Whoa, man. Whoa. Okay, I'm shipping my armies. I have become a great power. What? You're a great power. You're number eight great power in the world. Hello, Songhai, the Sultan of Songhai. We've heard you being hostile to the Kingdom of Portugal. Explain yourself. I, Sultan of uh, Songhai, want to assert dominance over... West Africa. With the foreign powers such as Portugal in the area, I don't have the ability to uh, solidify my power. We simply are just traders. We have trade ports here on the Ivory Coast. We're not taking any land in the inland or anywhere inside of your trade or contesting your trade. Right, Seems then. to me you're simply being hostile for the sake of being hostile. My opinion, if anyone cares, come and get some motherfucker. How dare you tell a Christian of the great Iberian Peninsula, what to do in Africa. Be a man and fulfill what you have threatened via letter. Or I shall come and pull you out of your little hut made out of dirt. You have two months. I would agree to warfare if there was a um, fair uh, 1v1. What, what, what is 1v1? What, what, what is this? You think this is the future? This is the knowledge. I have many enemies and my biggest friend is God. I'm never in a one-on-one. -on -one. I'm always with Jesus. 
So now, don't be afraid of what you started. You can pay me a tribute of 1,000 gold, and your people will be saved from war. Well, here's, here's the here, here is the problem. The nation of Songhai has been in national debt. I can't afford a long war, and I thought threatening would uh, threatening. No for shit, man! You you're telling me to my face you were bluffing, man? You, you, what the fuck, man? I feel like bad, you. bro. No, I feel bad. <laughs> Jesus. <sighs> Well done. Currently, Songhai has taken on almost 3,000 ducats of death. I'm very sad for you, but that ain't my problem, for Jesus has arrived. Listen, the only way for peace after your unbelievable threats against my great nation is that we demand Ijebu and Benin to be given to the great trade organization of Portugal in Africa. In return, I would like the province which is located in the Timbuktu trade mode. You ain't demanding shit, Mr. Free K thousand dollars in debts. How about you assess the situation and realize that Jesus has come for you? You're lucky you leaving this room alive, sir. Well My advisors tell me to give you commands, but my advisors are goddamn heretics and shall all be hanged. I see your army. It's weak. Well, Look, that's kind of fun. Boy King, Boy that's King. Really maybe we can stop man. this this hostility and maybe we can even work together one day yes in exchange of benin and ejebu i would actually give kumaz that that's that's how humble we yes. christians are man i accept your deal very nice i'm declaring war and we're gonna just make a peace deal instantly i you're getting killed by rebels man what are you doing maybe you want Rebel. to be my puppet <laughs> are you <No>. okay <laughs> you got this man just give me my two cities and then good luck so yeah shanghai uh, how did this uh, aggression against portugal go man how did that go um... huh? the f of portugal man don't do it Oh, we can actually, it's like a map app, you can see everybody. You can see how big everyone is. Oh, who's taking Louisiana? Is that Norway? Oh, man. If I was England, I'd be so mad at Norway. If I was England, I'd shit on Norway, bro. This guy's making Japan. Yeah, Shanghai seems like he's out of the game. I can just kill him later. The Netherlands, uh, f I f don't like the Netherlands. This guy offends me hard. And it's time to talk to England again. One sec, I want to talk to England about something. Habibi has to be careful. He might be too appeasing with Morocco and then we create a golem. I feel so dumb right now, though. I, I feel like uh, someone like a BB who just deaths all the time crushes me right now. I want to death too, chat. But now I'm going to death and you guys are like, you did it wrong, Tommy. You did it wrong. Just, you know what? Save your points. Here's what I recommend. Save your points. And when you have the time in between now and next Sunday, watch my dev guide. I okay, I'll, I will. I'll send it to you. And it's really worth giving a watch. Should I take all of Benin? Because this Shanghai actually is yes. weak as f I was going to say, you could if you make a deal with Morocco, you could just kill him. Your first player killing, Tommy. I feel bad for him, man. Hello, Shanghai? Morocco just declared on me. That was... Uh, oh, okay. oh, oh, you're fucked. GG, man. And the writing's on the wall, Shanghai. No one's... If no one's there to protect you... Oh, shit, Portugal. Man. I think you might Can be done. Can you see the gold mines? I'm not asking for protection. I'm just asking... Do not attack me until... Uh, the war with Morocco is finished. Uh, uh, what do I get for that? You get a more fun player war experience. That's what you get. Nah, that sounds like a pretty bad deal. <laughs> you I always do you get a fucking ganker. That's crazy. Get him. That's <laughs> yeah, I'm going in one sec. Oh, poor guy. He's getting fucked. Told me the game says I, I'm getting 10 ducats from gold, but I'm actually not getting that because it goes directly to you, please. That, that's I what it money. means to have a pimp, bro. 28k is not ready enough to kill an undeveloped African nation that's already killed by Morocco. Minas Gerais. See mobs! Fix it! What? See, Mops, Minas Gerais, they're rising up in the gold mine. Oh, we mean they those guys. You, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm walking there now. It's, 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 uh, the miners are rising up. Yeah, Tommy, man, the people are sick of being exploited, man. I don't know what to do. Oh, Maybe you should uh, switch uh, to the kill them all, okay? So, get the money. <laughs> hey. So, um, the, you won't be able to get any gold mines from the store. He snaked your gold, Morocco snaked the gold mine. Yeah, he, he snaked the gold mine. top players. You should, you should Morocco is the danger Morocco. to you. Not you really lie. need to kill Morocco. Yeah, just don't don't mind the 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 like 50k troops. I'm moving. How do you have 50k? Wait, I'm do I'm dying. Habibi, I'm losing. I I lost everything. GG. You need more troops, Tommy. How the fuck is a guy who almost died of 50k troops, man? He's fuck? taking max loans. Like, oh, you can, I've what are last him. I just pay time, Tommy. He's gonna go somewhere. bankrupt very soon, and then you can okay, just okay, finish okay, off his okay, army. Okay, okay, okay. You're gonna need to build a call uh build a mercenary stack, Tommy. I got this. Easy. He should, shouldn't he be broke, man, this guy? He is. He's broke. bankrupting. He's, uh, but like I said, he's like a corner dog. He's taking out all of his debt. Shouldn't the mercenaries he's... then abandon him? He can literally just spawn mercenaries on you? That's so P. What advisor do you have? Morale or dis... You need a morale or discipline advisor? I'm going to morale right now. Boom, I just took the morale. That's instant, Plan yeah? morale. Yeah, yeah. And you have to wait the month tick for that one. Also, go into your clergy. Go into your estates. Go to clergy. And look for expansion zealotry. I'm going to kill him. Don't worry. I'm going to crush this guy right now. Wait, wait. Not all at once. Not all at once. 
Do the, your big stack first, okay? And then reinforce slowly with the 22s. There you go. We need another Merc stack, it seems. One more. And you got this. Don't worry, I'll help you out with money. Oh, you're going the oh, wrong no, way. Oh, no, you're changing the wrong direction. You're going the wrong direction. It's okay, we'll Scorch Earth. You need to make another Merc stack in Ijibu. Ijibu. Uh, I think I can't afford that. Ijibu. Take loans. Take loans or burger loans. Sorry, this is so dumb that a guy with no money can do this to someone. That's so stupid. Like, you just need to war to last, and after this, you get a bunch of land. Good game. Are you bankrupt? Oh, he yeah. just bankrupted. You won. That's it, Tommy. You won. Never mind. Yeah, you don't yeah. need to get a... Okay, delete your Merc stack. Delete your Merc stacks, and you're good. Oh, how but fast are they coming, man. Powerful. People are fast, dude. It's so crazy, dude. Every time, like, a player is in trouble, he just goes into, like, a Super Samo where he gets infinite mercenaries. Yeah, I think it's totally like you can only be in that state for a bit, you know? If you don't win the war mm. quickly, if you do it, you'll just go bankrupt, and then you're completely done. Sounds because like then the, everybody a rule would be nice that says, like, you can only have one uh, mercenary quarter at a time. Cool thing about multiplayer store, you don't have to be afraid of aggressive expansion modifier. You can just keep going, man. Boom, boom, boom. Especially when everybody's expanding like that, there's no way I left to join the coalitions. I've just realized that the trade in the Ivory Coast, it seems, naturally flows into Sevilla instead of uh, my own sort of portion where we collect trade in my country. Therefore, I'm willing to sell you the coastline, uh, Gabu, Sin, Kao, and Traza. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Very generous to 200 ducats. I think I want to take that deal since you've been very generous to me and seem like a great fan of my work. How do you think, Tommy, your first U4 MP session? Very fun. I had a lot of fun. It's overwhelming. I was a new guy and I think there's a lot of exploiting. Like a lot of people do exploiting stuff. I'll explain the... Which is hard to keep up with if you don't do them. Yeah, so playing Player Wars is not only about microing the battles, it's also about economic management weighing how much you should commit versus not committing and as the game progresses the player wars become a lot of fun it's not about the, the i'm not sad at the player wars just that you have to play a certain way if you want to keep up like you have to know the estates deeply you have to always unkill your air and shit i just got asked to sub in for tommy k he mentioned that tommy k is really sick and asked me if i would step in and play as like a, a regent or the sick king stepping in to you know pull the pull the strings of the kingdom and try to put put the kingdom on track economically and give give tommy k the richest portugal i possibly can i'm gonna play for this session and then hopefully tommy's feeling better and he can play uh plays portugal next week i'm gonna try to maintain all diplomatic relations that tommy had established i feel like that's what a, re a good regent would do